So yesterday, singer Joy Villa trolled half the country at the 2017 Grammy Awards. And as expected, liberal Twitter was going off. Who the hell is Joy Villa? I ain't even heard that name on a feature, let alone her own. So it looks like it's sexist and misogynistic to insult other women's image. Unless, of course, they're a Trump supporter, in which case you don't get any sympathy. Joy Villa wore a Trump dress to the Grammys. Most common Google search tonight, who is Joy Villa? Hashtag irrelevant. Hashtag girl why. Well, maybe that's why her album sales have skyrocketed. Who wore it better? Joy Villa. Wait, so they humiliated a black woman, but for some reason it's not sexist or racist. Do you support a woman's right to choose? Any thoughts on equality in the workplace? Well, that's an interesting question because you liberals are making fun of her for choosing to be patriotic and for choosing to wear her mega dress. Joy Villa was dressed at the Grammys last year. Looks like you're going for a repeat this year, traitor. So now she's a traitor for wanting to make her country great again. And let's be honest, she's much better dressed than any of you feminists anyway. Joy Villa, do you really think he's great in America includes those with your skin core and hair? Hashtag delusional. Oh yeah. Let's not forget that these liberals think that your skin colour dictates who you should vote for. Speaking of dictates, let's bring in the queen of liberal pop herself. Joy Villa, this is not what Madonna meant when she said express yourself. Oh, what did she mean? Did she mean giving blowjobs to people who voted for Hillary Clinton? If you vote for Hillary Clinton, I will give you a blowjob, okay? Or maybe by blowing up the White House and murdering the president? Yes, I have thought an awful lot about blowing up the White House. Or, you know, just acting like a deranged whore in general. All you bitches who keep complaining about it can shut the fuck up. The liberals, as usual, just don't get the message. They're making fun of a black woman, a person they would normally pretend to protect, for practicing her right to choose. 